for a stream, but I do have work today, so you know. If I'm gonna stream, I'm gonna stream now. Uh, just we're just gonna do some casual matches today, like nothing uh, super crazy or whatever the heck. We're just gonna be doing some casual matches, you know, <laughs> just uh, extra casual stuff. So yeah, we're gonna be uh, getting everything set up here and uh, we're putting everything in the chat. Cool, cool. So, uh, hope everyone's having. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. I know that I am. Uh, I have new stuff uh, running. I have a new set of headphones, so I can hear things a bit better. Literally, I got a fucking new pair of headphones as well for Christmas, so you know, I might as well have a little bit of fun with it, right? Longer cable too, so I don't have to worry as much about the cable getting in the way. But now it's not in the way of my feet. <laughs> anyway. Um, let's see who's online. Nice. But regardless, we're gonna hop right into some lower tier uh, battles today with uh, our good old friend the Ram Two and everything. Uh, hopefully, though, I'm gonna start researching once this th once this one is done. I'm gonna start researching the Scorpion and all that. So hopefully, we can get some stuff out of that. So we will, we will find out what happens, to say the least. We will see. Ooh, abandoned factory. Okay, so if I go up here then to A. If I move up to the A point, I might have a chance at winning. Just, just, just might. Just might. Alright. Okay. We're already starting mid-match, I see. I might be a cheeky little bitch and just fucking go to like uh I might go like right up to the A point area here and just deal some damage and everything, so we'll find out what happens. The fuck are you looking at there, dumbass? The Destroying me vehicles. I can pull off something, I bet. I bet I can pull off at least something funny. Okay, so there should be some enemies in and around this area. Hopefully. Once I'm hoping for enemy tanks. Traverse the terrorists, fire the guns, it's time for them to fucking run. Call artillery right over there. Fuck. Fuck me is what that guy is. They'll by their cost me a kill. Whatever the fuck useless. Defend the B point. I have dealt with worse. Critical hit 
got that guy's gunner. Critical hit got his turret. We no longer have the advantage. Hit did nothing. Hey awesome, how you doing? Or hey SG, SGP, whatever you want me to call you, I can call you whatever. <laughs> and boom! Critical hit got that guy's gunner. That's good to hear, that's great to hear. Target on damage again? Okay. So anyway, SP, uh yeah, I'm in the middle of uh, destroying a fucking KV1 with a ram. Never mind. I didn't kill it, but I I do this all the time. I don't kill it, and then I get like a bunch of damage. Right. Where? <sighs> trying to claim the tracks. I'm trying to do like a little claiming the tracks idea. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. We're gonna push up here, gonna push up a little bit. We are pushing up hard here, so. But there's something right over here that I want to shoot at. So, uh, where the fuck did it go? Oh well. Critical hit again. Hit. Again. Apparently that's a one shot, but it shouldn't be. Yeah, so apparently going through the side of a ram's turret is an insta-kill. Which it shouldn't be because the ram, you know, was able to fucking block shots with a turret like grazed. Enemy air, enemy air, we have enemy air. That is not good. Dealing with the enemy air. The light forces have captured a zone. Unless they don't notice you, and then it's a good thing. Catch up, catch up, catch up. You can do this, just gotta push it a little bit. Just gotta push the throttle forward and deal with that. Okay, that enemy air is actually down now, so we have a bomb though. We have a bomb! We do have a bomb. Which is good. The museum bomb is healthy. Do, 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 do. I didn't do anything, fuck. This is why I need, like, big cannons. Big, big cannons is what I want for a plane. Big guns, I need big guns. Cutting down to 50 so I can or even this just to slow it down so I can use combat flops. Those are gonna help out. Enemy air up there, okay. Mark 
dropped it for our allies here. Again. Well, that's a piece of a plane. Fucking oh, Christ, I thought it was an actual plane for a second. <laughs> hey, flying around and enjoying stuff ain't, 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 ain't a bad thing, you know, like, it ain't, it ain't too bad, like, <laughs> it's not illegal to fly around and enjoy existence. Yeah, at least today, oh, I, at least today, like, I work and then, you know, I'm not overly concerned about anything else. It's like just completing the job. So once that's done, I don't have to worry about shit. I have 900 fucking... I have too much. Too much free research. You know, I'm just doing battles on my own today, guys, just because I do have work, and I don't want things to last super long, if that makes any sense. Because work exists for a reason, and when you have work, you fucking do the work, and then, you know... Work exists for a reason. And I hate it sometimes. I think what I'll do is I can rush to get the C point. If I make if I make a mad dash to get the C point, I will get a bit of uh, research points or anything like that. And then if I can at least damage or drop bomb or even just land the point, I should get a bit of research points for everything else. And I'll just be uh, a little bit of a bitch and just call artillery on that damned bridge we all know and hate. And you know, and if you know what I'm bridge, if you know the bridge I'm talking about, then not so lucky you. <laughs> also, we might be doing um, a few different kinds of matches here soon. As in, uh, I'm planning on. Once my once everything is set up fully, I might be able to try to do some actual um, air arcade or something like that, just with uh, using a yoke and everything, because I'm getting a, like a plain yoke and everything like that, which would be fun to use for uh, air battles and all that. Should be interesting and fun at least. Enemy forces have captured a zone. Allied forces have captured a zone. But yeah, I'm getting like an actual plane yoke and everything for, uh, you know, all that good old aircraft and stuff. And I might be trying to hook up my VR headset properly and using a little, a little bit of War Thunder in VR or maybe even doing some VR chat through my PC and everything. Which could be fun. Doing VR through my PC could be very fun at least. For y'all to watch. Like, there won't be the Avatar because I'll be in the Avatar moving around like a maniac. Even still, that'd be fun. Like, being able to like, do all that VR headset stuff, that'd be pretty fun. At least to me, it would be fun. I don't know if it'd be fun for all of you guys to see, but hopefully it'd be fun to see. I'm just, I'm anything like, what kind of stuff do you guys want me to do besides, like, War Thunder or whatever the heck? Alright, Cause like we got options. Critical hit, damn. Hit. Undamaged. <laughs> fire the guns. Traverse the turrets. Fire the guns. It's time for them to fucking run. the turrets, fire the guns, it's time for them to fucking run. <laughs> oh 
of my favorite things to say in this game is just the sheer thing of just traverse the terror spiral gun. It's time for them to fucking run. Because if you don't fucking run, you're gonna get shot. <laughs> yeah. Alright, where are you? Enemy team. So I'm gonna drop something right over here. Oh. I'm trying to be a little bit crafty there. I can wait for you, don't worry. Critical hit got the engine caused a fire. <laughs> and this is why you have me on a team. I'm just a mean launcher. Killed it. Got the critical hit on it. He's now stuck there. And he's now dead. It, it, is this tending to go in god mode? Is it... dropped right in front of me. My tank said no. But in a mean way. <laughs> Got the transmission. You can't move. Another hit. Another hit. I'm gonna keep on hitting you until you die. You will eventually die. You are going to eventually die, young stuff. There we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to push up to get some ammo. Fuck yeah. Pushing up to get ammo, because I'm only at 21 shells. <laughs> they really can't do anything to me, because I'm in a ram. Holy crap, the FPS is terrible, because everyone in my house is using something. Goddamn. I'm just going to sit over here and get ammo. I'm gonna sit right here, get ammo, do this to better the, make the FPS better. I'm not really even worried, that's the funny part. Like, I'm not even scared because I know it's gonna happen, eh? Also, hey, hey, I'll see you when you move it, I guess. Like, it's like. Being in the ram is like the definition of, oh shit, the enemies are fucking not going to be able to shoot you. And then when they shoot you, it's like, oh shit, they bounced their shot at least seven times. Sorry for the laggy fucking stream. The FPS is just shitting itself right now. The artillery is on the position. Like, holy. Oh, just to be safe, I'll call out to go there. That way, and just do see what happens. Yes, I hit. Okay, so it's the effect, so I have to, like, turn off effects or whatever the heck it is.
to like tank fire or something like that, I'm going to have to turn off. thou enemies you must line up for getting shot in the forehead good job you did jack shit clean good job you did nothing you've done nothing besides so make me mad You have made you have angered the ram. You have officially forward gear. Undamaged. Critical hit. Hit. Thing's now dead. <laughs> Holy shit. Fix your shit machine. Christ. I'd rather not be running on like fucking two and a half FPS for a little bit, you know? Oh, I can fucking live this whole time. Yeah. Now this right here. This is, that's called going God. No deaths. Many kills. Many murders. <laughs> that's called going God mode. Whoo. 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 Let's go. Hey. Uh, nice. Nice, got some backup vehicles, happy ending. Yeah, got rewards. Bro, let's go. Holy shit, though. Fucking lag and everything is real, but, uh, is what it is. You can't change it. Um, hopefully, though, because this stuff is somewhat new. The only thing that isn't really new is, um, how the older stuff that's still in the machine, which could be impacting the, uh, FPS in general, as well as, uh, other people in the house being on stuff at the same time as me. Hey, I can test drive that thing, but I don't want to. Okay. I have a 3.0 plane now. <laughs> I have a 3.0 aircraft for Britain. And it's a bow fighter. I mean, I might as well fucking test fly at least. Just to see how it is, you know? Might as well just freaking fly around a little bit. I mean, it's a bow fighter, so it's decently maneuverable. And it has two engines, too, so that's also good. Oh, God. This is a duck. This is the fucking British duck. Dear God, this is a British duck, isn't it? Oh God, 
this thing's a British duck. How do you get this thing? That's my question. Fuck, I'm actually fucking. Hmm. Who knows? <laughs> So if I look at this, it's an aviation. Man, I might buy this thing. When it's over, I might buy it. But for now, you know what? <coughs> We're going to go into battle with this thing. We're going to be playing the British tanks for a dish match. And you know, just the British. The British tanks. No Ram 2 this time, but we have the English tanks. Sark six pounder. Time to rush the enemy a little bit here. So interesting setup for teams. I mean, I have the same shell as the Ram 2, so I should be fine. I have quicker maneuvering, too. British Puma incoming. <laughs> well, actually, the British Trees version of the Puma incoming. This is an actually South African vehicle, which is a very good vehicle nonetheless, I should say. It's very fast to maneuver. The only issue is it can get one shot very easily, and it's tall. It's the only issues is with this tank. Well, those are the only real issue with this tank is that it's tall. Yeah, literally, those are the really only these. Those are the real only like uh, issues with the tank is that, well, the armored car actually is that it's fucking tall as shit. And it can always be one shot just like that. And its recoil is atrociously bad. So, Cromwell it is then. Not as good of a shell, but a shell nonetheless. And I can also just call an artillery and just slug it out of the front line area. And it has a canyon flag on it, so you know, uh, bound to be good with this thing. <laughs> Hopefully. I have not played the Cromwell in a long time, so... We'll see how I handle it. I might just go for some kill assist, then die on my own accord, and hop in that bow fighter thing and just uh, duck some people, I guess. <laughs> the British bow fighter duck. Quack, quack, fear me. <laughs> do, 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 do. If anyone knows that song I'm humming, then cool beans. I mean, I am playing a, a British tank now, so I'm allowed to do that, you know?
Better this thing is a fucking marksman tank. I love it. Critical hit, love to see it. Bouncing shots in this thing too, it's fucking lovely. Now I remember why I fucking rem now I remember why I fucking love this thing. You fucking go in, and it just pop goes the fucking weasel. The only issue with it is when it gets fucking hit with anything, it just dies. <laughs> If any shell goes through, it's just like, ah, oh, yeah, fuck me. Just, 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 just fuck me. <laughs> Alright, finishing up my repair. Hopefully everything can stay this repaired. <laughs> Holy shit, though. This thing, the cro the, tr the Cromwell is just a fucking marching tank at low VR. It's a dream to play. Literally, I can fucking snipe this thing accurately from, like, across the fucking map. Like, I could hit shots with this thing. I remember this... But me triggering some fucking memories of fucking cross-map bullshit I pulled off with this thing and, and all that. <sighs> Brings a tear to my eye. Let me think, uh, you want to get shot with the fucking Cromwell? Then come over here. Did I see fresh meat? Oh, that's gonna hit by a fucking weight a little bit. Spawn protection. Ready? Pop goes the weasel. Ready for another? Oh. <gasps> oh, wait. Now that I'm dead. Wait, wait, wait. Now that I'm dead. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna go friggin' duck some tanks. I hope. And this is why you play the fucking. Th this is why you play Britain. They have some decent vehicles that you can fucking use and abuse. Now then, where are some enemy tanks? Show me the enemy tanks, my friends. Show them to me. Alright, okay, I can even take down this fucking plane. I'm going for it. One of these guys are about to get fucked. I got a critical hit with the plane. <laughs> oh my god, I fucking love it. Love, 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 love it. Oh my, I love it, I love it, I love it. Back in the fucking Cromwell I go. All of my British viewers are going to be happy that I'm playing some British tanks. That's all I'm going to say. Because holy shit, three kills with one tank. Like, 
not gonna lie, the Chrome was one of my favorite tanks back in the day. Because it was fast, maneuverable, and it could be like, ha ha, fuck you, bitch. <coughs> With his gun. You see, this is this is this is why I like to play the British sometimes. I don't play them as much anymore, but I have my own reasons why I like the British when I want to play them. And Christ, they are good. In certain situations. Oh yeah, wait, there's nothing in that shit. I bet, actually. Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. I know what I can do. I'm gonna use that and get a little bit of British aircraft. Perchance. Perchance. Why <laughs> do I save up just for this thing? The British Duck. Customization. You're no longer a British plane. You're Canadian now. You're officially a Canadian plane. You're officially a freaking Canadian aircraft, motherfucker. Hmm. Not bad, actually. For, I don't know what the British have for a squadron vehicle. Well, they don't. Alright. China, do you have anything? Navigation, maybe? No? Germany, you have that. And that fucking leopard. Right. I'm gonna make sure I invest my stuff. But yeah, no, um, I will say this, I like playing the Ram 2, it's a very good tank, and I also do like playing the British. Hell, I think actually, if I'm not mistaken, the British and the Americans and the Germans and all that kind of stuff are my highest, uh, BR stuff. On ground at least, but might be doing some air stuff soon once I get everything sorted out with air. <sighs> Ugh. And I also might be grinding down the British AA tree because of one fucking reason. This thing. The one thing that will destroy the world. And it's Canadian. It's Canadian, too. And I wish they would almost add, like, all, like, a bunch of, like, the Canadian stuff, like, the labs and everything, like... Imagine a fucking lab tree. Oh my god. That would be crazy. Like, literally, having a lab tree would be just fucking stupidly crazy. This is actually the furthest along I've ever gotten on one of these battle passes. Funnily enough.
So I need to get to level fucking 51 in order to get the bow fighter that I already like. Hmm. Either way. Anyway, guys, um, I'm gonna cut this stream a bit short. Um, I know I usually stream for a longer amount of time, but I don't have the time right now because I do have work in a, about an hour. As I don't have to be there for an hour, so I'm going to be getting off the stream right now. So sorry, guys, for just leaving me hanging, I guess, but I sort of kind of have to do that, sadly. But um, anyway, guys. I will uh, catch you in tomorrow's stream, which is War Thunder Wednesday. Anyway, have a great night, guys. See you.